Thank you for joining the City of Auburn for this brief tour of Auburn's Central Fire Station and the Auburn Police Department. We'd like to show you around to help identify some of the challenges our public safety professionals face each day. Welcome to Central Station, also known as Engine 3. Located at 555 Minot Avenue, this facility was built in 1972. Fire operations run 24-7 here, and this station is also home to AFD's administrative offices. While it was considered cutting edge when it was built, Central Station no longer meets the challenges of a contemporary and diverse fire service. Cancer and cardiovascular disease are the leading causes of firefighter death. Some of the biggest challenges facing the AFD in this facility are health risks due to lack of decontamination spaces, the proximity of the garage bays to the living and sleeping quarters, and a lack of adequate storage. Sleeping and showering facilities do not accommodate the needs of a diverse workforce. It has been difficult to prioritize gender privacy and accessibility in our current facility. Training is critically important for first responders. However, this training room is not large enough to accommodate the entire staff, not to mention that it competes for space with the in-house gym. Storage at Central Fire is challenging to say the least. There is a need for gear storage space that isolates our team from contaminated gear and from diesel exhaust fumes. Our live fire training facility, while unique and impressive, is not NFPA compliant. As you can see, protecting our staff from carcinogens, providing decontamination space for firefighters, as well as areas to clean and store their gear are among our greatest challenges here at Central Fire. Welcome to the Auburn Police Department, currently located in Auburn City Hall at 60 Court Street. All APD employees work from this location, and while this is a beautiful building, it presents some unique challenges for our law enforcement professionals. Auburn Hall was not designed with police operations in mind. In addition to sharing the building with other municipal departments and visitors to City Hall, one of the biggest challenges in this location is the physical separation of our staff. The patrol division works from the basement of the building, parking their cruisers in the courtyard and garage, while detectives, support services, professional standards, and administration all work from the third floor of the building. Modern law enforcement agencies are diverse, and ours is no exception. Undersized locker rooms, lack of privacy, cramped quarters, and storage constraints are frustrating and can affect morale, productivity, and our ability to attract new employees. Storage is another significant challenge facing the APD. From evidence and records to police equipment, uniforms, and supplies, storage at Auburn Hall is less than ideal for our team. Fourteen years ago, the Auburn PD's move to City Hall was intended to be a temporary solution. However, this building does not meet the needs of our community law enforcement agency and its officers. You'll be hearing more about Auburn's public safety building project in the months to come. To learn more or to connect with our teams, visit auburnmain.gov.